Hi Povern, thank you for being a part of the Teddy Jury this year. Can you start by giving a brief introduction of yourself and your work? Uh, hello, my name is Popo Fan. I'm from China, uh, but recently living in Berlin. Um, I'm a committee member of the Beijing Queer Film Festival. I have been working for it since 2007, and I'm also a filmmaker. Previously made a lot of uh, documentary featuring LGBT families in China. Now uh, in Berlin doing more fictional and experimental uh, short movies. And that your previous films that you made, I think they have been used as a sort of quite an activist purpose within China. I wondered if you think queer film can and should be used for activism. I think uh, film is definitely one of the very important tools for communication. Uh, so my understanding uh, about film in the beginning was uh, uh, something able to change the society. Of course, I was too naive. The world won't be changed just by film. Uh, so uh, I would say activism documentary is one of the ways uh, of uh, filmmaking. Um, so that's why also right now I'm uh, exploring more diverse ways of uh, um, filmmaking and more contribution to the um, queer film culture and uh, society. Mm. And we have uh, one uh, queer film from China this year, mm -hmm. um, and I wondered just generally what the queer film scene is like in China. Is, is there an issue with censorship at all? Yeah, unfortunately because of the censorship, um, no queer film will be able to show it on the big screen in China. Uh, so they have to work on the very bad situation. Uh, there is no money and very few people uh, could work on it. Uh, I stayed for the Q&A for uh, a dog barking to the moon yesterday. I was very impressed uh, how, uh, how much uh, 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 effect uh, that the, the director had made. Uh, and this is not the only case I can uh, see in China. Uh, any direct want to feature this topic, they have to uh, work 100 uh, times more than uh, people from doing other issues. So uh, I really appreciate it. Uh, and I'm calling Chinese government to uh, change the censorship system and uh, made LGBT topic to be able to featuring, uh, to be featured in film and to, to reach a bigger audience. And how do you think your background will help you with making a decision uh, this year for the Teddy films? <coughs> I think uh, uh, as a Teddy jury, I, uh, it's very important that we have a diverse of uh, background. Uh, so from my, uh, my uh, background, I can see uh, the issues um, uh, really lacking in the uh, society, in the film industry about Asian representation and also uh, being uh, on both sides of uh, activism documentary and uh, fictional experimental film. I uh, have a uh, very different... Uh, uh, <coughs> Sorry, <laughs> can, I, can I... Yeah, of course. <laughs> <coughs> oh God. Mm. Mm. I really appreciate actually that uh, the Teddy uh, Award organizer would uh, invite people from different backgrounds to be on the jury. Uh, for me, I think um, with the background of uh, the both activism documentary and uh, experimental films, uh, I have a, a wider taste and um, a different understanding about filmmaking. And in the same time, uh, I have noticed a very big lacking uh, the representation of uh, Asian uh, in the queer film industry and actually in the few, uh, whole art house movie uh, circle. Uh, so I would uh, give my opinion into this um, uh, from my angle into the result of the jury uh, giving a what. Okay. And what trends have you noticed recently in the queer film scene? I was really um, impressed that um, uh, the films we watch this time, uh, they're not only talking about the queer issue, but it's across uh, inter internationality with other topics, and uh, such like racial and uh, uh, class and uh, uh, very diverse 
kind of topic. Um, I, uh, so being LGBT is not just one label, uh, but it's just um, one uh, um, one of their uh, element in the life is not necessary to be the uh, whole st uh, structure of the story. And uh, secondly, I um, also feel uh, uh, a, a bit disappointed because so many films, they are technically almost perfect. They have big budget, they have a, a really good camera and sound um, uh, music, but um, uh, a lot of them are not really telling the story, uh, which make a big shame. Uh, I, um, I hope uh, there will be more films that really care about uh, what, is the, uh, what kind of a challenge we are really facing and uh, point out to them and let people think about it. Thank you. Oh, thank you.